Hi, hello, good morning, good evening, good afternoon. If you're new here, my name is Danielle and welcome to the vlog. Guys, today is the last day of Vlogmas. Like, we made it. And today is also the last day of 2022, which is like absolutely insane to me because it feels like this year has just flown by and like I'm in shock that 2023 is like tonight slash tomorrow. So for my last little like vlogmas video, I just wanted to like sit down, have a little chat with you guys, do a little like reflection on 2022 and like obviously my new year's resolutions because everyone makes new year's resolutions because even if you don't keep them, they're still fun to think of. So yeah, a little reflection on 2022. Um, great year. Obviously it has ups and downs because every year is gonna have its ups and downs because life can't be perfect all the time, but it was a really good year for me. Like, I'm gonna get wistful in a second here. So most of you guys should know this, but for those who don't, I started this year by making a list of 365 things to do like every single day of the year. So I had to make, a, I, had, I made my list and then I had to do one new thing every single day and then post a video about it. Originally I wasn't going to post a video about it, but then I started to because I thought that it would help me stay consistent with it and not just like forget about it. Cause if I had to make a video about it, then I had that like reminder in my brain, like you haven't posted a video today. So you haven't done your thing for today. And I stayed consistent with it guys. Like there are 364 at this moment. Cause I haven't done my thing for today yet, but like 364 videos of me doing something new every day. And like, they're all on my list. I'm just like sitting here really happy. My list though is absolutely crusty right now. Hold on, wait. My list absolutely like destroyed. There's a page, the, the last page is coming out the back because the year just like, it really took its toll on it. There's like weird black lines. I think they came from a pencil that was in my bag when I put my list in my bag on vacation. But like every item, is crossed out on this thing, except for one, which is the whole make a scrapbook thing, which I'm gonna do like right after I post this video. This list literally like made my year pretty amazing. Okay, so at the beginning of 2022, I was like really unmotivated to do anything. My life felt very boring. So I wanted to do something to like spice it up a little bit, even without like having to hang out with anyone else or like even some days just like leave my room. So I created my list, I cultivated it from my own brain and <laughs> random websites on the internet that were like, here, these, these five things that you can do to make your life better. And I'm like, okay, let's try this. So yeah, looking back from, the, from where I was at 2022 and now I'm like very happy because I've grown as a person and I've made new friends and like there's just like a lot of great things that happened and the list was definitely part of that. It wasn't the whole thing because obviously like it's just a list, but like it was a really good year. Like overall, just like very thankful for everything, but mostly thankful to God because he literally gave me this idea and like he actually gave me motivation to do it. I did get burnt out sometimes, but I stuck to it because I knew that this was going to be a growth experience, guys. The list is definitely going in my scrapbook. I don't know how I'm gonna make this happen because the scrapbook is like that big. So we're gonna have to fold it up, but you know what? I'll figure something out. If y'all are looking for something to try, the list, bro, like just make a list of something to do every single day. And it's like, you don't even have to do something crazy. You just have to do something small, like something that will better you or something that is just like a little moment of happiness. And I feel like if you have that one little moment of happiness every single day, then it compounds over the year and you can just look back and you're like, wow, I had so many happy moments this year. And it's just like, it's great. Okay, now moving on to my New Year's resolutions for 2023. My number one thing is to just like, not exactly do a repeat of what I did this year, but like keep the vibe of it. I want to keep like romanticizing all the really little moments 
like all those little itty bits of joy every day like I want to keep like drawing attention to those and noticing them because I feel like that just makes me an overall like much happier person by paying attention to all the small little happy moments instead of doing nothing all day and feeling bored and feeling like I got nothing done and just being sad all the time. Also, I want to get back into working out, which I say at the beginning of every new year. And then I work out for like a few weeks out of the year and then don't do it for the rest of the time. But this year, <laughs> I am saying this knowing that I'm gonna fail it again, but I wanna work out at least like once a week. But I feel like that is a realistic goal because I always start out working out like five days a week and then I burn out. So I'm gonna start by just trying to work out one day a week and then obviously ramp up. And I want to start drinking water more frequently because I don't drink water enough and it's a problem. So I'm hoping that the working out thing and the drinking water thing will go hand in hand because I like to drink water when I work out. So another thing that I wanna do is get back into reading my Bible like every single day because I haven't been reading it every single day. I've just been reading it off and on here and there. And obviously I wanna make that my priority instead of putting it on the back burner while I'm busy doing other things. So yeah, we're definitely gonna work on that this year. Also, I want to start reading more because I did read a few books this year, but not a lot. And I actually really enjoy reading. So I'm gonna read more books. Hopefully the books that I got for Christmas will help me with this because I've got like six books that I have to read. So also I wanna start a Twitch stream and I've been putting it off because I'm like, but it's like a lot of work to make one and then you have to stream on it and everything. And it's just like a lot. And I this year I'm just gonna be like, nope, you know what? We're starting a Twitch stream. So stay tuned for that. And last, but perhaps like one of the most important things is I wanna keep trying new things this year. So like this last year, I was trying new things and doing stuff that I'd never done before. And they were all like really good experiences. So I wanna keep like being adventurous and trying new things and just doing the stuff that makes me happy. But anyway, that is the end of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell so we can hang out every single time I post. And drop your New Year's resolutions in the comments below. And we could all try to do our new resolutions together. But I hope you have a great day, great week, great month, great year, and an amazing 2023. And I will see you in the next one.